What do you think about Karrion Cross, Brian? Is he going to be a main event guy? How's his promos? How's his work? How's his package, which includes Scarlet? Tell me your thoughts. Ah, well, there's a lot there. I've definitely thought different things about him at different times. I think he has a good look. I'm not ready to say he'll be a main eventer. I think the fire angle last week was botched, although in general, him and Scarlet have been pretty good as a package together. I think yeah. he loses a lot without her, and we've seen that in real time. Yeah. What were your other questions? Well, just basically the presentation. Do you think, because a lot of people are saying, oh, he's going to be a top guy. And we know Triple H obviously brought him back with that intention and they're pushing him. I think the hair is not doing him any favors. I think he looked more extreme bald, more harsh bald. We haven't seen that much of his work. I know somebody's going, oh, I've seen him wrestle a million times. So I'm talking about me. I haven't seen him that many times, but I don't have anything against it. I think whether he becomes a superstar or not, they're going to put him in the main event, so he's going to be a main event guy. But whether he becomes a real main event player and a superstar depends or not on whether he develops the ability to do these promos like the spooky video that they did. Whether he can do these promos in this style with no script Sounding like he really means it. It's him. It's coming off the top of his head. That's going to be the difference. Because the spooky video and the atmospheric entrances and all the, the different ways they're presenting him, that's great. That's fine. But when he verbally delivers this like he did in this video interview package, verbally his delivery sounds like that he prepared these remarks and he's reciting them. He's better at it than a lot of the guys, but he's still not there where when Scott Hall was razor Ramon and they had gave him an interview, they wanted him to say, obviously back in those days, you'd still change a lot, but Scott Hall sounded like razor Ramon and the shit was coming off top of his head, right? It was not prepared. It didn't sound rehearsed. Same thing with Nash, same thing with any Attitude Era star, any major territory star. The spooky stuff they're doing with Cross will work, but only if it, if it feels to the people like it's him rather than he's a guy playing this part. And I don't, I don't hear the inflections, I don't hear the, the emphasis, the meaning in the right place to where it sounds like this is him. And I guarantee you, he couldn't do this promo unless he or someone else had written it down and then he is memorized it and is reciting it. In other words, unless you can do this from scratch, when somebody walks up to you with a camera and a microphone and it would sound the same way as if it was written and prepared, blah, blah, blah then then you're you're not it's not going to get over for you you have to be that person and i don't believe the things he's saying to me now that i've said those things do you see what i'm talking about or did i do a crummy job of explaining no it? you do I, I do see what you're saying and i agree with you for the most part and you know when he first returned i remember i didn't watch smackdown that week but i saw a photo going around of him i guess he came out of the crowd and he attacked drew mcintyre or something but he was in his street clothes and he looked like a crazy badass who jumped the rail and got involved with a wrestler. And I think that's one of the frustrating things with him and Scarlett. They don't need the spooky shit. And we've seen way too much spooky stuff. We don't need to see any more wrestlers with smoke machines. Like, that can go <laughs> away. We've seen a lot of it. We've seen too much lately. You know, back in the old days, the wrestlers didn't need smoke machines. They just opened the door of their car. Well, I think part of the problem is Scarlett and Karrion Cross don't need all that, but because they have all that, it doesn't make them stand out like it would if they didn't have it. That was very deep. Thank you. As Mama Cornette used to say, well, that's a deep subject. Well, the rest of it will be surface level. I promise you that. All righty. Well, we'll do the best we can to be completely uh, surfacey. 